Well, good evening, YouTubers, friends, and family from across the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide, and we are on July 27th, 2018. Welcome to Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide. And here we're looking at a time-lapse video of some unstable air masses heading across Alberta and Saskatchewan. Um, over the last few days, there's been a lot of supercells forming here in Calgary, Alberta. But we got some other events to get to here. We've got heat wave across the northern hemisphere and fires breaking out. Uncontrollable fires in California. We've got hurricanes that have formed overnight due to the 630 kilometer per second solar wind stream that we had penetrating Earth. As you can see here on the disaster map, there is a lot going on in our world right now. And I thank you for joining me today. I know it's been a while since my last update, but I am here now and thank you for joining me. I apologize to all my subscribers who expect me to upload every day, but I've been working night shift and going to school all week. So I've been very busy and so is the world. So I've got a lot to get to here. So yes, heat waves all the way up in Finland. Now that is above the 25th parallel. Um, yeah, that's uh, really strange. Wildfires, heat waves. Right now, I think we're sitting at about 200 lives that have been claimed around the world due to these heat waves right now. And this typhoon Jungdari will be turning into a Category 3 as it heads straight towards Japan. It's expected to diminish, but we'll see. Around the world for earthquakes, Kilauea is still shaking. A lot of action there since that last eruption. This has been the largest eruption in our history. And around the world right now, our ring of fire is still very active. A lot of plate movement this last little while. There's been a, countless landslides across the planet. You search it up, those, are, those videos are out there. And literally, our crust is shifting and expanding. When we get these 5.1 earthquakes in the mid-Atlantic ridge, in the middle of the ocean, you gotta think something's up. Hashtag Grand Solar Minimum. Global cooling does produce more severe weather. But yeah, earthquakes, it has been very busy. Watch the Cascadia fault line the next four days. As we are closest and we are in transition with Mars and the moon. So here we are looking at Hurricane Gilma and Tropical Depression 8. As they're heading west, northwest, looks like number 8 might actually track towards... Hawaii, but Gilma, open waters, no harm to humanity. And here is Jongdari. This is its path over the next five days. And then you can see it joins with another low in the middle of the Pacific Ocean afterwards. So these lows, as I said, and I've been documenting over the past year with my channel, the low pressure systems are joining forces because they're stronger and they're bigger. A lot of strange events happening across the planet due to our collapsed magnetosphere. That's our shield. Looking here, higher elevations, Mongolia, a lot of snow and a lot of rain. So watch for extreme weather event in western parts of China and Mongolia. And of course you can see here with the dark reds, heat wave, unbearable heat. Parts of Africa are sitting at 48 degrees Celsius. You can see there in the Atlantic Ocean, a very large low pressure system, joining, pre joining forces with another one. Across Canada, we had a cool down 
due to that low pressure that came from the north. But now high pressure ridge is building in again and throwing a lot of very hot moist air back into Canada. So watch for temperatures to increase over the next few days. Monday be looking at about 33 degrees without the humidex. So watch for some more thunderstorms over the next couple days as things start to heat up again. We're just going to have a browse here at the northern hemisphere. Now most times with low pressure systems they'll go around, they'll diminish and then maybe um, the topography of another piece of land will create another low pressure system. But most of these low pressure systems have been spinning around our globe for weeks. The same low pressure system. So hang on folks, we're going through some changes together. And humans are best at adapting. So no worries, just need to stay aware and prepared. And that's why I created this channel, Morning Dew, daily events worldwide. Documenting, analyzing, observing, watching the skies for you. You can see those large low pressure systems in the southern hemisphere, bringing floods to uh, southeastern Australia and Tasmania, and also southwestern Australia. Atlantic hurricane season. Not much to talk about there. That high pressure ridge is still dominating. And here's a look at satellite imagery of Zhong, Zhong Dari, Zhong Hari, sorry. And you can see its track heading north, northwest turning into category three over the next six hours and then heading straight west into the southern parts of Japan where they've been dealing with all these floods. Very intense storm. You can see the low pressure spinning just, whoa, just left of the typhoon. They're set to join forces and smash Japan in the next 24 to 36 hours. So watch for reports coming out of Japan as they deal with that. So as I was showing earlier on the earthquake map, the major earthquakes over the last 48 hours, and yesterday there was another large volcanic eruption in Hawaii, followed by a 5.0 in the Servo Sea and also Sandwich, South Sandwich Islands this 5.4 now the 5.4 is very close to my volcano that's right the Michael Volcano but yeah now that I've talked about this volcano watch for activity because most times when I start investigating and talking about a volcano, it becomes pretty active. So just going to go over the last 24 hours again for earthquakes. I want to thank you for watching today. Today is Share Frenzy Friday. Get out there, share with your friends and family from across the world. Morning Dew, daily events worldwide. Posting my severe weather analysis and disaster alerts from around the world. And from now on, day to day, I will be reporting in the morning. So watch for my uploads in the morning, folks. Thanks for watching today. This has been Mike with your Morning Dew. Stay young and have fun and get your Morning Dew. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. enjoyed today's video please hit that like button subscribe share with your friends and family from across the world
Thank you.